Hey family, good morning. Um, happy Sunday. Super excited for today. It's been a super busy weekend. I'm on my way to a um, conference here in Houston. Yesterday I had I went to um, a uh, black author support group slash workshop that my friend was putting on. And now I'm in the line to get me something to eat. Just a couple of tacos before I go to the conference because I'm not sure they're gonna have food. And the conference is like three or four hours, and I'm not trying to go all that time without without eating. So yeah, I'm gonna vlog as much as I can at the conference. Hopefully, I am able to do that, and I'm pretty sure that I am. But uh, I'm super excited to go. You can't tell, but a sister's truth. We're representing. Um, I have to get me more AST t-shirts like this. Oh, and it's laced up at the back. I gotta get me more cute AST. Eight nineteen. Sure. Thank you. Thank you. I gotta get me more AST shirts like this too, so I can represent when I'm going okay. out. Thank you. And it's also oh. Nope. Uh uh. Thanks. So I can represent when I'm. Thank you. Nice you too. So I can represent when I go to different events and functions, you know? So, yeah. Just wanted to just um, hop on real quick just to say good morning to you guys. And, uh, yeah, I'm about to get on this road and eat my food. See y'all in a minute. So whether it's character development, where it's, whether it's narrative, whether it's figuring out what to write about to begin with, um, whatever it is, like plot development, ideation, word count, editing, anything, we're going to give you each time on the floor just to talk about what you're writing about, where, you, where, you, where you're coming from with your piece. And then we're, after you say your piece, then we're going to go around the room and you're going to get feedback on how she can develop her work. He, she or he can develop, <laughs> develop their work and um, take down notes, do what you need to do to help you get through your next piece. And then at the end, we're going to come back and make action items. And I'm going to share more resources with you guys for the time we have left. Sound good? Okay. Who wants to get started? Uh, I'll go first. Yes, um, okay. I'm uh, currently in the process of writing. Two say your name, say your name. Oh, I'm sorry. My name is Joe Omar for everybody. Um, Thank uh, you. Yes, uh, I'm sorry. I'd like to say. Oh yeah, I'd like to say. Yeah. No problem. <laughs> environment. 
I was exposed to every form of abuse you can possibly think of. And so, um, as a child, I'm sure all ladies or anybody really can relate when you are exposed to um, certain things in life, you become comfortable and normalized with those type of bad habits or that abuse or, you know. Women who look like me who would come into my industry would be through just working my way up in corporate America and getting into a position to be like a gatekeeper. Um, but God had different plans, as he you know, usually does. And it wasn't until 2014 I found myself in a very great depression. And for me, I didn't know I was depressed. And so it, it got to a state where it was my body telling me, hey, there's a problem. And um, similar to what she was speaking on, talking about depression, it's so important because for me, I didn't have awareness of depression and I honestly was very prideful. Um, I didn't think something like that could happen to someone like me. I thought I was too you know, intellectually inclined to become depressed. Like, what is depression? What is that? You're sad one day? Okay, that's how I thought. And um, I didn't, I wasn't aware of the illness, so I was easily, uh, you looked easy target. And when I was sick, I was so used to suppressing my emotions that I didn't know I was sick until I had. in the vlog <laughs> hope you guys had a good time hanging out with me today hopefully you enjoyed the footage from the conference because it was it was really good you know i love a good come up story or maybe you don't but i love a good come up story and just hearing the women share their stories you know where they were to where they are now is just amazing i just love it loved it made some connections so preferably some um, profitable collabs come out of those connections um the conference did have a couple of mishaps that's not even worth me mentioning so yeah it was pretty good i need to get back out and uh go to the grocery store actually pick up a few things for the week but um yeah man hope you enjoyed the little bit of footage that i had from yesterday's black author um slash writer workshop seminar you know because I, I i didn't really pull out the camera as uh as much but hopefully you enjoyed a little bit of footage and hopefully you you enjoyed the footage for today so if you haven't already please hit that subscribe button and also thumbs up this video make sure you ring the bell so you can get notifications every time i upload a new video and i will see you guys next time peace